Hello again. Right, uh, so <clears throat> this should have been trade two for the day, uh, but as you know from the previous video, I missed uh, this setup here, so I just waited patiently for the um, price to do its stuff and uh, took my long trade here to R1. As always, I cut my um, target short and um, I actually closed this manually. It went uh, a couple of pips beyond where I took my profit and I got 12.6 pips out of this. <clears throat> but when it starts to turn a funny color, in other words, red against green, um, I uh, always close and uh, because I'm looking for the burst and uh, if it bursts up then great I've got the extra few pips I need if it doesn't go as fast as I expect it to to my target then I will um, not be greedy there's no need you know plenty of trades to come so the the reason for this trade the entry was purely because this we got two rising candles low high once this green candle here had broken the high of that candle and we could clearly see we've got the break of the 20 here but I didn't want to enter without two green candles I talk about that very often um, you know uh, this is a downward candle so I want to see two green I don't perhaps I don't mention that enough but uh, then combined with you know the break of the 20 on that one was good enough to really enter the trade by but I as you know like my belt and braces and stuff like that this broke the high of that one so I'm talking about this one broke the high of that one when I entered the minute it had gone above the high of that I was all over this like a rash bearing in mind that was good enough to enter long this was uh, the belt and braces situation so uh, I don't uh, say this enough but you need you can just scroll across the tops of these or put your mouse on the top of these and you will see their true levels you have to do it a couple of times for some reason it uh, it can give uh, differing figures so just use a bit of common sense when you're looking at them 3645 I think it must have some lag in it 3757 and so on and so forth this one 2059 this one 2169 so the minute you've broken that one I'm really all over this like a rash and as you can see it moved uh, best part of 15 pips up to the R1 and uh, notice also that it uh, virtually came back to this valid ascending trend line here validated by these moves through here so uh, that's it guys, patience and discipline, just wait carefully for everything to come into alignment and um, you can uh, trade with confidence. Okay, there was no need to really wait for a confirmation here, that's worth mentioning as well, because we hadn't confirmed down. Okay, we hadn't, this is the low, the high, the high, low, the higher high, high, low, lower high lower low it didn't break this low at any point or close below it so there is no need to wait for a reversal to the long side which in this instance uh, in this small pullback here would have been the break and close above that one there so you would have missed the best part of the move if you had waited for a close there I hope that is clear guys we're in alignment with the higher time frames. We're still in alignment with the 15 minute. I'm talking about the reversals long, the 30 minute, the hourly. The hourly had confirmed literally just before uh, entering that trade at 7 a.m. But it was already confirmed long on the hourly here. And we hadn't reversed here again, so we didn't need to worry about this confirmation here. I hope that's making sense it should do with the more experienced people if it doesn't with people that are new to this channel please watch a load of the other videos there's over 200 maybe over 300 now there are no shortcuts to trading guys don't ask me questions that are probably in the previous videos 
that is the biggest red flag for me guys it shows you're not you haven't got the what's necessary to become a, a professional full-time trader if you ask me questions that are answered in the previous videos that might sound harsh but you know they say it takes 10,000 hours to be an expert at something I think I've done three possibly four possibly even five times that studying this stuff so you owe it to yourself to do your homework so lecture over thanks for watching have a great day and um, green pips to all of you and don't forget if you like my stuff I've got a lot to offer I am prepared to answer videos about my videos uh, answer questions about my videos in personalized videos to you just ask the questions either on Twitter or on YouTube and like and su subscribe on YouTube please and retweet on Twitter likes are lovely but retweets are what build up a community here and I want to help as many people as I can. Traders helping traders guys. Thank you and have a great day.